Hi, my name is Peter Kasten. I've been taking pictures for a long time, and it turns out I like taking pictures of people I've met on my travels. Last summer, I spent time visiting and living with the flower of Hmong people who live their lives very close to the earth. They live on the land in mountains near the Chinese and Vietnamese border. They grow their own food, make their own wine and noodles, and raise water buffaloes to make things meet. When I returned to America, I had an exhibition of the portraits at a museum at the Florida Institute of Technology. It was a big success, and it was up for three months. When I visited the pictures, I kept on thinking that the portraits were asking me why they were in Florida and not in the mountains of Vietnam. This is why I came up with this Kickstarter proposal. People come to the remote mountains on the Vietnamese and Chinese border to see and take pictures of these beautiful flower of Hmong people in their clothing at their Sunday market in the small village of Bac Ha, Vietnam. Tourists come in buses and vans just for two or three hours, take a lot of pictures and leave. The generosity of the flower of Hmong has impressed me deeply always allowing strangers to take their pictures. I have tried in my pictures to offer the opportunity to see the beauty of the clothing, but also see deeper the rich humanity of these people. These are people, as I said, that live close to the earth. There are three parts to this Kickstarter proposal. One is to make a book, a photo book, uh, 100 books, copies of portraits of the flower of Hmong to be given out to them who give so much. There are no galleries or movie theaters in Baca, no bookstores or museums. It's quite likely, unlikely that many flower Hmong have books at home, especially not art books. So this is an opportunity to give them something special and unique to share and have in their homes. There is one, two, there is one beautiful building, uh, the Royal Palace of the Hmong people, Wang Tuang, in Bac Ha, that is open to the public. I'd like to put up a photo exhibition in this building, if possible, of 20 large portraits of the flower Hmong and invite the community to the opening and have food and drinks and ice cream for the kids something never before done in this part of the country. Yeah, the first photo show ever in Baca, but what's even better is that the pictures will be only of local people, all the pictures. They'll be printed in Hanoi, each one 48 inches high, and after the show in Baca, I'm going to rent a space in Chiang Mai, Thailand, which is a home to many uh, Hmong people to show the pictures and then bring them to Hanoi, Vietnam to show and attempt to sell the pictures with any profits to go to an organization that helps the Hmong community medical needs. I think I can do this whole project for $35,000, all expenses. This includes travel from Miami to Hanoi to Bac Ha to Chiang Mai to uh, to Hanoi, uh, back again to Miami, living expenses in the hotel, taxis, printing, framing the pictures, renting vans, shipping the books, having assistants help me negotiate with the government and civic leaders, food, and unexpected challenges. Also, we'll hire a local videographer and photographer to record the highlights and post them for all to see. If you would support this artistic and humanitarian project here are my thank you rewards. 50 bucks will get you an original photo magnet with one of the limited edition portraits printed on it and a thanks. 100 will get you a soft covered 20 page photo book exactly 
the one that the Hmong will be getting in Vietnam. And 200 bucks will get you a hardcover 20 page book. That too, exactly the same as the Hmong we're getting. Thanks for making this exciting human to human project happen.